Supreme Court's decision has thrust Pennsylvania's governor's race into the national spotlight. The two men running, Josh Shapiro on the Democratic side and Doug Mastriano, the Republican, are on completely different sides of the debate. Chopper 3 was over as Shapiro rallied in Old City this afternoon with Planned Parenthood. Eyewitness News reporter Howard Monroe was there on the ground. It's just amazing to me in 2022 that we are going back to the 70s. Hundreds of people rallied outside the National Constitution Center Saturday at issue the Supreme Court's decision to overturn Roe versus Wade, which protected abortion rights federally. This is nothing short of a national health care crisis. We are here to move forward as a country, not to go backwards. And I think it's just basic human rights at this point that are under attack by by those in highest power. While it is still legal for a woman to have an abortion in Pennsylvania, the issue is now front and center in the governor's race. Republican Doug Mastriano is against abortion and said he would ban it if elected. On Saturday, he tweeted, SCOTUS has put the issue of abortion in the hands of voters where it belongs. Democrat Josh Shapiro echoed that sentiment, but from the opposite side. When I announced my campaign in October in Pittsburgh and in Abington, I spoke about reproductive freedom, I spoke about the importance of having a governor that defends it. It went from theoretical to reality. You wouldn't be telling men what they can and cannot do with their bodies. We have every right in the world to make our own decisions. Howard Monroe, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Now, Mastriano was not available for an on camera statement, though he did release this on Friday, quoting Roe versus Wade is rightly relegated to the ash heap of history. As the abortion debate returns to the states, Pennsylvania must be prepared to lead the nation in being a voice for the voiceless, end quote.